Engineers, product designers, and manufacturers choose SLS printers for design freedom, high productivity and throughput, and the ability to directly print and use parts. Most selective laser sintering, or SLS, systems require extensive training, tools, and effort to prepare and maintain. The Fuse 1 changes the SLS landscape, bringing the ease of use central to Formlabs products to powder 3D printing. The ability to print production-ready parts in-house means you can rethink product development and take control of your own manufacturing. Hi, I'm Rosa. And in this video, I'll walk you through the basic process of using a Fuse 1 3D printer and Fuse Sift powder recovery system, including software and setup, printing, post processing, and safety. Every 3D print starts with software. Formlabs Preform software is designed to make 3D print setup, management, and monitoring simple. To start a print, first export your design as an STL or OBJ file from your favorite CAD software. Open the file in Preform, our free and easy to use software that prepares your design for 3D printing. Then choose your material. Several versatile production ready materials are available. For maximum throughput, each Fuse 1 printer and Fuse Sift should be devoted to a single material. Cleaning the hardware to switch materials will take about one day. Densely pack the build volume to print as many parts as possible in one job. Duplicate and organize multiple parts within a 3D array to quickly pack the build space. For smaller jobs that need a fast turnaround, the Fuse 1 only uses as much powder as the job requires, eliminating the need to fill the entire build chamber with powder for every print. Once your print is ready, send it to the printer via USB or Wi-Fi. A full color touchscreen guides you through every step of printing and maintenance. Before starting your print, load powder to the Fuse 1's hopper using the powder cartridge. Next, open the door and insert a clean optical cassette to protect the printer's optical system. Then, insert a build chamber. Having multiple build chambers in your workflow enables you to run another print while a previous one is still cooling. The Fuse 1 monitors itself over time using computer vision and notifies you whenever a print has failed or if a maintenance procedure is required. Once all the preprint checks have been completed, the Fuse 1 is ready to print. The preprint checks usually take about 10 minutes. SLS 3D printing fuses plastic powder layer by layer. The unfused powder supports the parts during printing, so you can create complex interconnecting designs with no need for support structures. Patent-pending surface armor technology prints a semi-centered shell around the surface of the part to provide competitive mechanical properties and surface finish. During printing, the Fuse One's camera feed provides a live stream of the print bed so you can watch each new layer take shape directly from your computer in Preform. The online dashboard allows you to monitor print progress and check material supplies, effectively managing a fleet of Formlabs printers and users across locations. The print time shown on the touchscreen includes the recommended cooldown time, and your Fuse 1 will let you know when your parts are cool enough to take out. Transfer the build chamber from the Fuse 1 to the Fuse Sift to finish cooling. The Fuse Sift is a safe, efficient powder recovery system for the Fuse 1 that helps you maintain a tidy workspace. This all-in-one station combines part extraction, powder recovery, storage, and mixing in a single freestanding device. Gradually eject the print cake from the build chamber into the workspace. The Fuse Sift includes both a touchscreen and physical controls for easy access to key functionality while parts are being cleaned. Scrub and scrape powder from the parts using the provided picks and brushes or other tools of your choice. A wire basket is provided to neatly collect your parts while you continue processing a print. Wipe any powder that accumulates within the workspace into the sifter to be recaptured for later use. The sieve filters out particles to be remixed with new powder and reused in future prints. Fuse Sift will dispense and mix used and new powder automatically so you can reduce waste and control your powder supply. 
Collect any remaining powder from the workspace using the vacuum, controlled by a button conveniently located on the control panel. Reduce downtime by transferring modular build chambers and powder cartridges between the Fuse 1 and Fuse Sift for a non-stop, cyclical workflow. A media blasting cabinet, which uses compressed air and an abrasive media, is highly recommended to remove any final powder residue from your parts. You can use any media blasting system that uses glass or silica media and has a workspace large enough to encompass the Fuse 1 build volume. Some users also supplement their workflow with additional brushes, vacuum cleaners, or compressed air for final cleanup after media blasting. SLS parts can also be spray painted, dyed, vapor smooth, electroplated, and coated to achieve different colors, finishes, and properties. For example, water tightness and conductivity. From the machine shop to the office, the Fuse 1 is versatile enough for a variety of environments with the right safety considerations. When in doubt, always reference the safety data sheet in manual and consider any local regulations. Our Fuse 1 service plans include training sessions that cover powder safety and handling. Final prints from the Fuse 1 balance strength, flexibility, and detail, so parts are ready for rigorous functional testing or to ship ready-to-use products to customers. Control your entire design and development process from iterating on your first concept design to manufacturing finished products. It's time to rethink product development and take control of your own manufacturing. The Fuse 1, production SLS, finally within reach.